everybody welcome back to my channel if you're stopping by for the first time my name is Fumi. nice to meet you I hope that you enjoy your stay here if you hear a child in the background that is my wonderful son <laughs> it's a family business I have no babysitters today <laughs> less here so today we're going to have skin we're going to have beauty we're going to have makeup and i have missed it so very much ysl was so generous so kind as to send me their new foundations yes darlings they have evolved and they have added 11 shades diverse beautiful shades making a total of 33 to their collection as a matter of fact i have them right here Thank you very much YSL, that was extremely generous of you. And I am going to showcase my match today. I'll, I'm going, I will show you of course the four that I got, but I want to show you how it looks on my skin. I have used YSL foundation before. This is a new foundation. And of course they have more shades. On top of which Fenty Beauty also came out with 50 shades of concealers. I got two. They have a wonderful setting powder that I got in hazelnut. And I also got the darkest shade in their foundation. They added also 10 more shades, making a total of 50 foundations for Fenty. So this episode is about skin. Yes, darlings, we are going to try it out. I'm going to do half of my face first so that you can see the comparison and then we'll go from there. Okay, my loves, if you're wondering where this beautiful bonnet is from, it's from Nembus. I'm going to put her Instagram link below and I love it. She's in the UK here, but she ships internationally and it's a small brand that I want to support as I think she's doing amazing. Absolutely love this. So I wanted to try it out. All right, guys. So Elle Saint Laurent, let me tell you, it is the all hour foundation. Need a night to night mat? We've got your back. All Hour Foundation comes in its most diverse shade range ever. Congratulations YSL. I am truly, truly impressed that these high-end brands are becoming so, so diverse. This wasn't the case just 10 years ago, just five years ago, it was not the case. So without any further ado, let us start. I am going to prime my face and I have the Pore Professional by Benefit. Yes, darlings. Put it on the tips of my fingers. I'm just going to dab it on my cheeks. Well, everywhere else actually, where I have pores. I have a mirror here, so. That's Adrian testing out his vocal cords. <laughs> he's such a lovely baby. I cannot believe he's going to 15 weeks. Yeah, 15 weeks has passed by since I gave birth to him. And he's turning over and he's crawling. Amazing. Alrighty, so let us go with the B90. Yes, da 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 da. And I have my artiste brush. So I'm gonna put some right here on top. Let me just get this going. Voila. One, two, couple more. And just touch. Look at it. Oh. And put that in. Blend that in with my artiste over eight. Oh, it just feel like full coverage. I will say that. Yes, it does. Do, do, do. Let me wipe that off. So I made a mistake and I put it on the other side of my face. So I just wiped that off so you guys can see the difference. Can you see? And look. You want to go a bit closer? Yes, you can go closer, Dad. Thank you. You've got some on your blouse, so make sure you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so this is the B90, that's the beige 90, the darker shade in Saint Laurent, and then look at the other side. Do we love? I do. Ula, what do you think? It looks nice. It does look nice indeed. All right, my loves. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll do the other side, yeah? <laughs> like I told you, that's my son. <laughs> oh, 
now i had worn this as soon as i got it i was so excited i had worn this and if i have the clips i'm gonna put it because it was on my insta stories hello my loves no filter i'm wearing the all hour ysl foundation and i love it i really really do yeah aha there you go isn't it fabulous oh yes this is a must must my new fave oh that's ula <laughs> and adrian <laughs> see you later <laughs> and i loved it they were right it stayed put and it really just glowed and i have little skin tags here so i just covered those up you know but it still makes your skin look natural and that's what i like about this mm -mm 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 -mm. and there you have it yes darlings okay uh -huh. yeah all right so now we're going to go with fenty beauty fenty beauty and so i got two i got a 410 to highlight and then i got a 480 for a skin corrector just to correct the imperfections i might have on my skin on those days i don't feel like wearing foundation you just spot correct so i'm going to show you right here let's say for example there's one there yeah and there's another one here i can just dab with my finger like so and just go over that do you see voila there you go so that was the 480 you can see it's a bit lighter than the 490 now i have the 410 foundation and we're just going to spread it across yes so go over here and here and here yeah what i've come to realize and this goes across the board for all um concealers i like to use a beauty blender it just works for me put it down here put it down here crisscross crisscross let's try that yeah with the wet beauty blender should i use the green should i use the pink should i use the green okay let's use the green let's use the pink let's use the pink okay so they just dab in Ooh, it is full coverage guys mm-hmm that's adrian i think i've said it before i think he's trying to pull <laughs> yes <laughs> ula said he's taking care of business yes. right there in his bouncer <laughs> and i've just changed it that's another thing with babies adrian i will bathe him i'll put him in the cutest little outfit five minutes he's pooped yeah i'm telling you he she does that yes you see he's laughing <laughs> <laughs> that's babies there's nothing you can do nothing you can do you have to go with their ammo i like this and a little bit underneath my nose hmm okay darlings so let us try the setting powder the setting powder i got in a nutmeg and guys you can get uh fenty beauty online you can get it on her website as well as having nickels here in london and i'm sure you guys can get it everywhere else in the united states okay so this is the setting powder and what i liked about it is that you have like a plug so when you open the setting powder you know how it can be loose and you have all of that powder right there that's what the nutmeg looks like this is the shade let me put it in front there you go you also have this look and so when you're traveling you can put this on top like so so that you don't spill any just like i already have <laughs> but that is the purpose of it so when you open your package and you're wondering what is this this is just the stopper to keep from everything falling out yeah Alrighty. so i'm going to take my beauty blender again i'm going to save my money here less money and i'm going to take the excess that spilt off and i'm just going to put that underneath and set it and just see how that looks mm, nice and milky i like it 
it's so funny there are a lot of shows for children but I feel that they're a little bit too violent I never noticed it before until I had Adrian so now we really just look through a lot of cartoons and make sure that they're not too violent I don't want my son to take a frying pan and hit it over somebody's head and think it's funny but that's a lot with Tom and Jerry so Ula has found Curious George and he's so cute so he watches that and he watches the fireman isn't it Ula? Fireman Sam. Yes, Fireman Sam and Curious George. So we showcase. Oh, it smells delicious. It smells like cake mix, guys. Oh, Fenty, good job. And I hear that she's coming out with accessories. The other day she was walking down the street like she does and she was wearing a pair of Fenty sunglasses. Apparently sunglasses, accessories. Yep, Kat Von D is coming out with shoes. Hmm. Yeah, it's on and popping. I love it. So that's that. So you know what we're going to do? I have a little surprise for you guys. Oof. I got the darkest foundation from the Fenty Beauty line, the 498. And I'm going to use this to contour. I wanted to show you guys how dark and gorgeous this is. So I'm going to put some on the back of my hand. There you go. Look at how dark that is. Woo! So happy. I'm going to take my Juvia's Place brush. And I'm just going to just look at how dark that is. So when I want to cream contour, I will use this all up into the hairline and then do it right here on the jaw. Yeah. That's dark. Oh, I'm loving this. Okay, and I'm just going to blend that out. Just buff it out. Oh, I love it. And it gives you that chiseled, chiseled look. Yes, I love it. Oh, just look. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. And then I'm going to use my setting powder and I'm just going to give it a chiseled effect right here to pop that cheekbone. Yes, yes, darlings, I love. Do we love? We are loving. Okay, yes, we're done. All right, guys, so what do I think? What do I think? Congratulations, YSL. You are FDV approved. The foundation is yummy. I had tried it out the other day, and I wanted to try it out for you guys, demonstrate the diversity and the deep shades that they had. Congratulations, because five years ago, this was not an option for us. YSL has deeper skin tone shades for us. Amazing. It feels gorgeous. It feels like skin, and I just love how it complements my complexion. That is one, as you saw, it covered everything. Fenty Beauty, I salute you. You're doing it. That you even added 10 more shades for the foundation. You are everything. I mean, I just give it to you. There you go, honey. There you go, there you go, there you go. I love the concealers. It's thick. It's yummy. You know why? Because I am religious. And you can go to all of my Instagram pictures and you can see. There's not a single time I don't use the Estee Lauder Double Wear Full Coverage in Sandalwood. I get my friend in LA to even go and get it for me on Amazon. Ship it to me. That's how desperate I am until this came along. Very nice. Very nice. It's always great to have options. So, without any further ado, my loves, I am going to finish my face on camera. We're going to speed it up and then I will come back and show you the final look. But I do love it. Yes. All right, guys. See you soon.
All right, I'm done. All right, guys, do we love, are we loving this African-esque? That's how I just kind of turned out. I love my skin. I love my skin. I love the way it looks. I love the Fenty concealers. Congratulations. But I knew you guys were going to be bam, bam, bam. I just wanted to try it out for you guys. But for the Saint Laurent, well done, Miha. I adore. This is going to be one of my new faves. I'm always about foundations. I'm about skin because it's not every time I'll come out full on with eyeshadows and all of that. But I want to have a lovely complexion. And as you can see, it's just really just melted into my complexion. And it looks like skin. It absolutely looks like skin. Mm -mm -mm. So, Ula and Adrian. Is it FTV approved? It is absolutely FTV approved. Congratulations, Yves Saint Laurent. <laughs> Congratulations, Fenty Beauty. <laughs> and of course, Juvia's, you are fabulous. Use my discount code FUMI. And that is it for this episode, my loves. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, to subscribe, hit the notification button. It's a family business. So please follow my beautiful niece at Crafty Unicorn. And I will see you guys next week. Ula, say goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, my loves. Mwah. <laughs> Adrian, what is he doing? I don't know. Maybe he's booked now. Maybe he's <laughs> Gotta go. Mommy duties. Alrighty. Bye, my loves. Hope you enjoyed.